What is the goodness of the Lord? How do we end up actually looking towards what's called for us? If I call on the name of the Lord, the Varach Adonai Yahweh, you know, you end up having an ability. It is a spiritual perception. The different dynamics that we end up seeing within the spirit actually open up your heart. So that if we end up calling into the Lord, Yeshua, in battle, the machine, Jesus, the Son of David, the Messiah. The idea is to take that blessing and show it. You have to understand the Word of God dwells within the heart. It's actually within creation. So that the more that you end up using the Word of God, sowing it into your heart, the more that you have an ability to therefore create the miracles of creation itself. It's taking John 1, literally, and understanding that with the Word, the reason that we see the parable of the soul in every one of the different Gospels is because it is the good news that we ourselves have the ability to plant and so forth and create miracles within this world. Spiritual growth that we eat from the vine, the vine is actually the nourishment. You are connected with this, and because of that, it shows us that Jesus gives us all the keys. But Jesus doesn't mean that. He speaks the word of God. You have to call on that, build that, and look towards creation itself so that we can have divinity. Look towards this and realize that God Himself is there for edifying, building you up, and giving you love. The mind is divinity, but it's also that ability to share the grace of God. If we look towards Jesus, Yeshua, living beside Yeshua, then we end up seeing exactly how God teaches us to have perseverance, minus fidelity, grace. And that grace itself is there for the need to change and to give us a new perception of the Creator. We look towards God, and He ends up looking back at us with a smile, with peace, with perseverance. Jesus is eternal salvation, He's the light of all the world. Because of that, thought, we share forth the very goodness of God, and He gives us, over and over again, abundance, prosperity. I open the doors to the heavens. There is nothing as blessed as knowing Christ. And that's our message. I want you to have that blessing. I want you to know that Jesus is there with you and that he's going to open up a new door for you. That he's going to give you a future, a hope, a blessing because of love. Because you love the Lord. Take that love and share it with everyone that you know. Let them know that Jesus saved you. That he forgave you for your sins. And that because of that blessing, he's opening a new door. He's opening the gates to paradise. That's the blessing. Call him. Believe he's Lord in your heart. Confess him. And receive him. Go in the door and create a new future for you, for your family, for this nation. God bless. God bless America. And I'll see you.